Hi all, this is Sia Naz and in this video I'm going to show you how to make a beat visualizer in FL and this is for people that are brand new to FL and not sure so I'm going to take you step by step from the start. So the first thing we need to do is um, get a folder that's got the beats in there so we're going to go to the top here and go options and then file settings and then click on the white folder here and select the folder you have your beats in I put mine here and as you can see it's popped up here beats so let's close this and now let's get our beat so this one is called sunset and it's got a very old school feel to it so let's close that over and let's have a listen So just a lovely old school sound um, and so that's just that little circle there that you press on and then you can also press on here at the top too so two options so now we need to make the visualizer so we go up here and we press on the mixer this button will bring up the mixer and then go slot one and then down to the bottom Z game editor visualizer and then it brings up the windows and we'll put this one the gray one on the left and this black one on the right and the one on the right is going to have the image get it right and so now we need to add our content so add content and then add pictures and then find your folder, go and beat videos, sunset, and this one picture here. And now we go to main, and then we go to none here because we want to see the image, so you press on image, and then we go image source, and it will bring up your picture. And make sure that the size is all the way over. And this is just a basic sunset picture that I think I got from Upsplash or Pixabay. They're really very good um, places that you can find pictures that are free. And then just in paint, I just wrote sunset by CNS Beats. Okay, so just before I was about to upload this video, I found out that you can add text in FL. And it's so evident when you see it. I just assumed that you couldn't, so let's do it now. So I've brought up um, just the sunset on its own without the writing from paint. And what we're going to do is add content and then text, like it's right there. I've been playing with it, that's why it's, it's open. Um, so text and then just going to write down uh, sunset, which is the name of the beat. I see a Nas Beats and then we go back to main and then we add a new layer and then look over here text and there's you should play around with this which is what I've been doing but I just want to keep it really basic so just text true type and then what we have to do is go down the bottom here, single line mode. We have to press that. And there's the words right at the top. So I want to get it to the bottom. So position Y all the way to the bottom. And then I want to change color. So let's go up to the paintbrush. And I want it red. And there you have it. <laughs> you can do the text in FL so let's continue with the video so then I want to add the circle so we press the plus sign over here to get a new layer and then we go down to here polar and there we have our circle and to get it bigger or smaller you just go here radius and then position X is side to side and then position Y is, is up and down. So let's have a look. So I think that's a pretty good spot there. 
looks a bit crooked. I think I don't have these um, the words um, centered. And now I want to add an extra element. So we're going to press the plus again and then go none. And now I just want to add something a little fancy and it's fluids. So you can play with any of these and it'll add a layer to your beat visualizer. So I'm selecting this one. And as you can see, it brings this up. And let us move it around. So let's make it bigger because I want it to be the same size as the circle. And position X side to side and position Y up and down. So I think that'll be nice. So now let's play it again so we can see it bounce. So there we have it. And now I'm thinking with the circle, I want to add a color. So let's go back to polar where the circle is that, um, it, that will bounce. And we go to the paintbrush. And then you can select a color. So obviously I'm thinking like orangey. Let's go to that orange. So now let's have a look. I think we can change the little bugs as well. So if that's yellow, maybe we can make those little bugs orange. So let's go here. Yes, we can. Oh, wow. That's nice. So I'm just going to leave it like that. Otherwise, it'd just be playing with it all day. So now we've gotten it to where we like it. And let's start playing that. And so now we need to export it. So export video. And then over here is where you change where you want it to go. So I want to change it to F drive, beat video, sunset. Sunset Beat Visualizer Save. So the preset is that we want a YouTube HD and then we go Advanced Export Settings and here, let me just check my notes, we want uh, the video bit rate is going to be 60 and then frames per second is 30 and the audio bit rate is 320 and then we will copy these details here because um, we want to put it um, in the information when we put it up on YouTube so people know where where we got it just to credit these people that we've um, th they've done all the work and we're just using what they've done so it's just to credit the people and then press OK so we're just double checking everything looks fine and then what we do is press start and it will start rendering so we just wait for it to render and then we can play it Okay, so the beat has rendered, so now we just need to find where we saved it. So I've saved it in this folder, and it's here, Sunset Beat Visualizer. So let's have a look.
So that is how you make a bit nice and easy in FL Studio. If you've got any questions, leave them below and I'll leave it to you. Happy creating. Thanks for watching. Bye.